People ask me, uh, is this an event about CSR? It's also about CSR, but it's, it's meant to be bigger than CSR. And a couple of weeks ago, I uh, saw this commercial. We have got a problem. A few problems, actually. We're overproducing. Overcrowding. And overheating. We've got aging roadways. Aging power grids. Aging everything. The question is, who's going to fix all of this? An actor? Probably not. But you know who can solve it? Business. So we're going to start with uh, Gregor Half. He's the new Dean of Education at Copenhagen Business School. And we need to have an idea of, well, what is the society in 20... 30 or the society in 2050, what are some of those key capabilities that you would want people to have in 10 years, in 20 years, and in 30 years, so as to solve some of those wicked problems? As consumers, we are looking for more than a good deal when we consume. It's about reputation and it's about value. Can we actually create a safety movement? Because that is what it's about. It's about can we inspire people to actually be active in their community, in their street, in the school to provide a more safe uh, environment. And just like the SAP uh, advert was saying, you need to understand what's going on in the world and try to bring that into the innovation that you have inside your company. This has been the year of great floods. So this year we actually launched a new product. It acts as a buffer below the ground to absorb water from heavy rainfall and it avoids uh, squares or schoolyards from being flooded. So when we're thinking about a product, we don't start by thinking about, you know, this is going to be a great selling product, but this is going to impact people's lives in a very positive way. But the mainstream expectations are that business is part of helping solve problems in society in general, as part of the definition of business, not just in the CSR activities.